Hello grandchildren, how are you? Today you will find another episode of Valheim. In it, we will finally kill the first horned boss with you and get an item from him that allows us to develop further. This means that very soon we will be able to mine new metals and melt them into ingots, thanks to which we can create a lot of new and interesting things. With that in mind, let's get started. Enjoy watching, grandchildren. Since in the previous episode, we have already prepared for the battle with the boss, this time we immediately go to summon him. I hope we are prepared enough to defeat him. Wish me luck grandchildren and I won't let you down. Along the way, I pick berries, get animals and various resources, because it never hurts. finally arrived at the boss spawn point. In order to summon it, we need deer heads. I'm lucky to have them in my inventory. Let the great battle begin. The name of the first boss is Ikva. It's a huge deer that blasts electricity left and right. Dangerous guy. But not for me. I can dodge his attacks. But if I do not have time to react, it will not affect my health level, because his attacks are weak. However, this does not mean that you should relax old Max. has very little health left, so I want to taunt him a bit. And I'll try to finish him hand to hand without using weapons.
Oh yeah. Finally, the boss fell to my greatest kick. Now I can make a pickaxe from his horn, which will allow me to mine copper and tin. It's just wonderful. Especially the amount of time that I will spend on their extraction. I was able to get a queen bee, which means that near my house I can put bee hives, and now I will have honey. And again a two-star deer. It pleases me, especially the amount of resources that falls after his death. It's time to hang the first boss trophy on this boulder hanger. This will allow in the future to activate the power of Aktor and receive a buff to endurance when running and jumping. Finally we are at home. I'm very happy about this. Now I need to cook food, sleep and create new upgrades, create new tools, build beehives and much more. Simply put, to do the necessary small things so that in the future it will be easier and more convenient for us to survive in this world. I made the mistake of starting to cook the meat before I went to bed, and of course it all burned to hell. This can't be allowed anymore, although coal will come in handy in the future.
now I will build a couple of hives so that they passively bring me honey. It's nice to know that the food in my house will definitely not run out now. I will put all my resources in chests so that they do not take up extra space in the inventory, and lie in their places. I will also chop some wood for future crafting tools and improvements. Now I will build the first workbench upgrade. This will allow me to create some new items and upgrade the existing ones to the second level. I have collected enough deer skins and can afford to make myself new clothes and a helmet. It won't make me a Hercules, but now I'll take less damage from Greylings. And now the same treasured pick from a deer antler. We have already taken a step into the Bronze Age. This is great. On top of that, we'll be putting this new flint lance to the test soon. And let's replenish the supply of fire, flint and ordinary arrows, because they too often end at the wrong moment, and because of this I have to chase a deer around the whole forest. and I will immediately improve some items, I think this will definitely not interfere with me. I like my new spear, especially that it can be thrown. I think this will be very useful to me, especially if I run out of arrows. At this point, this episode comes to an end. It was a very hard day because we killed the first boss. In the next episode, we'll be mining a bunch of new metals, and we'll be exploring skeleton dungeons. I will be glad for your likes grandchildren, see you in the new series. Goodbye grandchildren.